Okay guys, so now we finally have a second to breathe. We just got done with Gillian's um, plastic surgery appointment and this was to see if he needed a helmet because he does have a bit of a flat head um, just because obviously he's not able to like roll around and move like other babies. So the back of his head is a little bit flatter. I was honestly thinking that he was for sure gonna need a helmet, but Thank God the doctor said that it's just mild, that he's okay, he won't need a helmet, um, which obviously is great news. So I totally just recorded a whole spiel of everything we've done and realized I wasn't recording. Let me catch you guys up on what we've done. It's about 10.30, we have an appointment at 11, so we're going to start driving over there. He's currently eating and moving his bag around. Um, but we're gonna go do that. We just got done with his appointment. That was at 9.30. Okay, you guys, I've been having so many technical difficulties with everything. My phone, the baby's feed, everything, everything. I just need to take a minute to breathe because everything that could go wrong is going wrong. But it's okay. It's okay, we're still gonna have a good day. We have gotten so much done already. I feel like I gave him a bath. I took a shower, I washed my hair. I did my hair and God is going all by 9.30. Well, by nine because his appointment was at 9 30 so yeah it's been a busy day and hopefully i'll be able to chat with you guys some more after what's wrong young mood you trying to talk trying to say something <laughs> uh, but hopefully i'll be able to chat with you guys some more later when things calm down a little bit because it's been so hectic i don't even know how this day in the life is gonna go because <laughs> it's well mi amor. you want to tell them how your day is going tell them How's it going? <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll see how this day in the life goes. But in reality, it's really how it is. It's a crazy mess sometimes. Okay, so now that I've got a little bit more time to talk to you guys, um, we're currently at his therapy place. We're about to start soon. Um, he's currently sleeping a little bit. I don't know if you can see him, um, but I'm giving him a couple more minutes to sleep. I don't know if the other stuff is gonna be all over the place. It probably will be, but like I was just trying to say that it's been a busy day. Um, sometimes, especially 
when you have a child who is special needs, your day's all over the place. And I'm bouncing from place to place. For example, we were at the hospital for his appointment. Now we're over here at his therapy. And that's on top of all the basic baby stuff like feeds, diapers, just dealing with a baby in general. Um, so it's just kind of having to balance it. But we made it and it might seem chaotic and that's because it is. Um, but that's okay. We get through it. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm going to go to his therapy now and hopefully I'll be able to get some clips of him and show you guys what he's been doing and how he's been doing. Sorry that the lighting is trash, but we're in the parking garage. I just got home and I'm gonna make myself something to eat, put him down for a nap and see what I can get done around the house and then get us ready for the day and then go pick up my mom, I think, so she can come along with us. So I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so we are home now and something I just wanted to show you guys real quick, just in case you didn't notice is I do use this type of stroller just to get him up and down from the apartment since we're in the garage and since he's not really able to hold himself up and sometimes I'm carrying a bunch of things um I just find it easier bringing him up in this and it's super small so I can just put it away in our closet um so yeah and in the other clips you might see him in a bigger stroller and that's the one we use to kind of go around places um help us it's a little bit easier to use well it's bulkier, so I don't like bringing it up all the way over here and take up so much room. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know. Verdad, Gorda? Say hi. <laughs> yeah, good job, Babash. <laughs> just gonna take it easy for now Kilian's playing in his mat right there I'm gonna let him get tired out so he can take a nice long nap um and I'm just gonna eat watch some tv take it easy breathe just because it was a pretty crazy morning already so um I'll talk to you guys once we start getting ready for the party okay before I forget I wanted to let you guys know about these they are so good they're like spicy and perfect and you just throw them on the air fryer and perfection <laughs> it's about 2 30 now we're gonna start getting ready Kilian is napping um and while he naps i'm gonna get ready and then hopefully once i'm done i'll just change him real quick and then we'll go pick up my mom Okay, so makeup is all done. Um, hair is okay. My curls are falling out, but to be honest, that's how I like them. I don't like them too curly. I just like the wave. Kilian is still sleeping, so while he's sleeping, I'm gonna pack his bag, pack his food, um, his medicine and everything he might need. And then after that, I'll probably change or he'll, I'll change him first. I'll see what I do. But just gonna try and get some things done while he's still sleeping. Yeah. 
So I'm just separating Kilian's bag and um, I like to have six diapers and I only have four so I'm gonna get a couple more. I have his bottle here and his um, feeds. He's only gonna have two more bottles after this. He just had his two o'clock one. Um, so I'm just gonna put those in there once I'm done. But I wanted to show you guys that I have this like little cube set up and like I have his diapers in here and like his lotion and wipes and like after bath stuff um his medicine in here and like syringes and random things like that so um yeah i just kind of wanted to show you guys and i have like all the things separated like toys and feed stuff and all that sorts of stuff So Kilian's diaper bag is basically packed. We've got diapers and his medicine and stuff. Um, what we do need to get is his pump going, but it needs to get charged. So I'm just letting it charge while we wait. So as usual, I'm running a little late, but um, it's 3.50. I'm on my way to pick up my mom and she lives about five, 10 minutes away from me. So I'm gonna go pick her up and then we're gonna go drive to the party. Um, it starts at four and it is a surprise birthday party, but I think we should be fine. I don't think they'll get there right away, so it should be okay. Okay, so I went to her mom's house and she doesn't need a ride anymore, so that's fine. But I realized I forgot Kilian's chupon, so now we have to go back to the apartment and get that. Um, hopefully we don't take too long. The place isn't too far from where we live so we should be okay um yeah so hopefully we'll still make it before my aunt gets there Okay, I look exhausted because I am. I'm in the parking garage. I just wanted to end it here. Uh, before I forget, honestly, I'm just gonna get Gillian all ready for bed and then get myself ready for bed. But before, I did go and get some cousins. <laughs> um, I did eat over there, but I just felt like having some cousins. But thank you guys for watching. I'm literally just gonna take off my makeup put on my pjs eat my cousin subs and call it a night thanks for watching and hope to see you guys again Ooh.